So we've seen a spate of some very brazen cell phone robberies in New York City that's been attributed to a Venezuelan gang called Tren de Aragua, which has its origins at a prison outside of Caracas. A number of the gang members escaped in September 2023 when the Venezuelan government raided the prison. And a lot of them have come over within this surge of migrants from Venezuela into the United States. In the last fiscal year, there have been like 340,000 encounters at the U.S. southern border with Venezuelan migrants. Among those, Border Patrol has apprehended 41 Tren de Aragua gang members. Law enforcement says they are infiltrating cities in the United States and maybe forming alliances with gangs that are already established here. We're seeing the presence of Tren de Aragua in New York City. We're seeing all these brazen cell phone robberies where two guys on a moped will go onto a sidewalk in Manhattan and they will steal a cell phone out of the hands of somebody who's actually talking on the phone. This is important because if you're talking on the phone, your phone is open. So the guy on the back of the scooter just keeps tapping the phone so that all of your apps are open. And then they take it back to a gang leader in the Bronx where, you know, a hacker goes through and drains people's bank accounts. The phones are then bundled up and sent to Colombia where they're resold. So it's, it's suddenly a big menace.